the top three get their full card for next year on the Ladies European Tour, that would obviously be very nice to get. You'd avoid Q School then altogether. But right now my goal is to stay within the top 15, have two good finishes now and reassess and play hopefully well at Tour School. The first, the first stage of Tour School, you're trying to just get through it. You don't necessarily want to play your best at the first week. You want to kind of play your best then when it really counts in the final stage. So it'd be fantastic if I just got through to the final stage, I could just go out and play a bit more freely. Yeah, I've been kind of coming around nicely, started putting well, so the scores have improved. That was been my downfall all year. Hitting it really, really well, hitting a lot of greens in regulation and not holding too many putts, so started putting nicely, so I'm looking forward to next week, yeah. It's quite difficult to manage yourself, manage your budget, because it is very expensive. But um, I, have a good, I have a good group of people I travel with and we cut costs by staying in apartments and cooking our own food and it really is good fun. Yeah, you, when you get out there you make some friends and you kind of put the golf to one side and you can still have a bit, have a bit of crack in the evening. That makes it all kind of worthwhile. I was quite lucky this year I got four invitations to play on the main tour. So I got to kind of have lunch with the likes of Laura Davies and people like that, like my idols Sophie Gustafsson and that. And just even getting to speak with them is fantastic. That's where I want to be, that's where I want to play golf been fantastic. I've got a great company on board now, Whitby Seafoods. Um, they've been superb this year. I couldn't have done it without them. And the Irish Sports Council, between the two, they've really made this year worthwhile and uh, they've made it r realistic. At the start of the year, I really didn't have any money at all. I had to sell my car to, to just pay the first few events. So having the backup of the Sports Council allowed me to get to the events and then hopefully perform then. Without that, I wouldn't be able to get there at all. I would like to be still playing golf, hopefully on the on the ladies' European tour, the main tour, and enjoying it. That's really it. They, there's no point in saying I'd like to have ten wins or being be world number one. We'll just keep enjoying it and see what happens. Royal County down here have been absolutely fantastic. I'm so proud to call this place my home. Um, the, the members have just been like there's not even words to describe how supportive they have been of me, encouraged me all throughout my whole career to be able to come and play a course like this. Um, oh, it's fantastic. Both sides have been superb. Um, they've been both sides have been really welcoming to me to play. Always checking up my results, asking me how I'm getting on, um, and it's so world renowned that everywhere I go, people have heard of the course. So everybody has a connection with it as well, which makes it really personal.